Let's talk about the difference between the pull-down menus at the top of Peachtree and the navigation aids down at the bottom. Many people are used to using pull-down menus in various different software packages such as Microsoft Word and Excel. However, we'd like to encourage you to use the navigation aids at the bottom of Peachtree. The navigation aids are helpful because they organize things in the normal process flow of accounting transactions. For example, let's look at time and billing. Time and billing helps us to organize both the database and the tasks and the reports. Let's look at this. Under maintain in time and billing, we have a couple of items that we sell, activity items and charge items. When we click on activity items, that brings us to the maintain inventory items screen. Over here to the right, when we set up an activity item, we'll need to change this item class down here to activity item. A typical activity item that we would charge for would be consultation. We would put in a billing rate, and let's say our billing rate is $100 per hour. Here, we might want to put in a more detailed discussion of this charge item that will appear on invoices. And in the description field here, we would need a name. Oftentimes, it's the same as the ID. We'll save this item. Notice when we save it, the item class turns to gray. This means that after we've saved it, we cannot change the class of this inventory item. Now, if we needed to do that, if we needed to set up an activity item for time and billing using the pull-down menus, we might stumble around for a while to find out where to do that. We'd come here to Tasks and look under Time and Expense. We'd come into Time Tickets, and we would wonder, hmm, here's our activity item. Where do I set that up? Well, knowing Peachtree and the pull-down menus, we would know that we come to maintain inventory items. This really doesn't make sense to a new user of Peachtree. Is consultation an inventory item? Well, no, it's not. So that's why we encourage you to use the navigation aids at the bottom because they flow from left to right and help you set up things properly. Errors most often occur in Peachtree when things are done out of order. So we can set up our activity items, our charge items, such as faxing and copying and long distance calls. Here we set up our employee billing rates, what we bill out our employees at to our customers. If we have any vendors and subcontractors that we charge through to the customer, we would set them up here. And then of course our jobs. So if we were using the pull-down menus, we would have to go to a variety of different places to set up our time and billing cycle. Let's look at another area. Let's come here to Company. Under Company here, this helps us with new company setup and company information. If we were to compare this to the pull-down menus, New Company Setup is under the File menu, and Company Information is under the Maintain menu. Once again, 
we feel it would be easier when we're working with company wide information just to come to the navigation aid. Here's where we can import and export information into and out of Peachtree, back up and restore our year end wizard and action items, products and services, which are our inventory items, and jobs. You'll find that, that through using the navigation aids, you'll be able to set things up quicker and move through your Peachtree much easier.